Hello everyone, my name is Ian Lamont. I'm the author of Google Drive and Google Docs in 30 Minutes. Today I'm going to be talking about the Google Sheets mobile application and how to remove a file that you don't want and permanently delete it. And this is for the Google Sheets mobile application for iOS, which might be an iPhone or an iPad. So let's get started. Here's a Google Sheets app on my iPhone. You can see I have a whole bunch of different documents here, uh, Excel spreadsheets as well as Google Sheets native documents. And the way you can tell the difference between them is the Excel documents will have an X next to them, such as the, uh, the iMac versus MVP.xlsx. In the Google Sheets, they have this weird uh, green cross thing uh, next to them for the icon. So what, happens, what happened here is I have two versions of the same document. One of them is in Excel format. One of them is in uh, Google Sheets format. And I want to get rid of the Excel version of it. So this is what you do. Next to the title of the, doc, of the uh, file you want to get rid of, the spreadsheet you want to get rid of, there's three dots. Tap the three dots. That means more actions that you can take. And a, a list will pop up showing all the different actions that you can do. So you can make it available offline, make a copy, share it. Actually, on this one you can't share it because it's an Excel document, but you can do other things to it. The very bottom, it says remove. Now, notice it says remove. It doesn't say delete, uh, but there is a trash can next to it. Basically, when you tap remove, it puts it in this special holding pen, and from there, uh, it'll be moved to the trash, but it won't be deleted permanently. And that's an important distinction. So let's just remove it for now, and then we'll take a look at it and see what else we can do with it. So I'm going to tap Remove, and it's gone from my main index view. So tap the icon in the upper left corner. It looks like three horizontal lines. It's called the hamburger icon, I guess because it kind of looks like a hamburger, but it looks like three lines to me. So tap that, and then you'll see a whole bunch of different options there. The one that we want to look at is trash. So this shows all of the files that you put in the trash, and now you want to get rid of them permanently. So what I want to do is just to permanently delete the one that I just put in there. That's the iMac versus MVP. Again, tap the three dots that are next to the file name, and there's just a few options actually. One of them is to restore it. That means if I tap it, it will be brought back to my main index of spreadsheets, uh, both Excel and Google Sheets files that are stored in the Google Sheets application. The other one is delete forever. Now, delete forever, that, that means exactly what it sounds like. It'll be gone for good. In fact, you'll be prompted. Are you sure you want to do this? Yes, I want to get rid of this thing forever, and it will be gone. Now, um, if you wanted to restore it, of course, I would have chosen the other option. And also, if you want to get back to your main screen, showing all the different files that you have that are active, that is get out of trash, tap the hamburger icon again, the three horizontal lines, upper left corner, and just tap recent. And it used to be it used to be there, and now it's gone. For more information on how to get the most out of Google Sheets, check out my book, Google Drive and Docs, in 30 minutes. It also covers Google Sheets as well as other Google applications, including Google Slides, Google Sites, Google Forms, etc. Available from in30minutes.com. And thank you so much for watching.